This demonstration overviews how TeamCenter Rapid Start seamlessly integrates with Solid Edge to provide thorough yet efficient management of data for both design engineers and management. This is the TeamCenter Rapid Start home screen with an intuitive Windows 10 look and feel. These apps provide easy access to such things as our favorite data, common searches, and our to-do list. This interface is available directly inside Solid Edge or from a web browser like we have here. It even works cross-platform, including tablet and smartphone accessibility, ideal for managers on the move. TeamCenter Rapid Start includes a set of pre-configured electronic workflows for engineering change control. Here, we're reviewing an engineering change notice, or ECN. The workflow display uses colors to quickly communicate where we are in the process. Green indicates completed steps, yellow is the current step, and blue shows steps that have not yet been started. Reference data have already been linked to this ECN. Here, we're reviewing the base frame assembly of our master mover electric tug device and can navigate around the complete bill of materials for this sub-assembly. We have full control over what revision is being displayed for each part, for example, as last shipped or latest working. Here, we're using latest working so we see the latest revision of every component. As mentioned earlier, we can do all of this work from inside Solid Edge too. Let's jump into the shoes of a design engineer and experience this seamless integration. For this ECN, we've been asked to replace the current motor with a higher rated motor. We search our Team Center database for parts that start with the designation MM. This returns 340 parts, and we can see that these parts have already been classified into categories like purchased and machined. We know that our motors are purchased parts, so we select that category, and a further classification is displayed. Finally, we select the motors filter to display a list of the motors in our database. This search technique is highly intuitive, just like shopping on a website. From reviewing the details of the high capacity motor, we can see that this holds a solid edge part model, a JT file for rapid visualization, and a specification sheet in Excel format associated with it. One of the benefits of TeamCenter is the ability to store data of any electronic format so that complete technical information for designs is easily accessible. This includes support for other CAD data besides Solid Edge, perfect for multi-CAD environments. We'll drag and drop the motor into our Solid Edge assembly design session so we can position to the new motor correctly. Jumping ahead to where the new motor has been constrained correctly to the mounting plate in the base frame assembly, we can see that we need to modify this sheet metal part because there's an interference. Solid Edge's synchronous technology is ideal here to quickly make the design change, but wait! We're notified that the mounting plate is released part and cannot be modified. That saved us from quite a costly error. Before deciding to create a new revision of the mounting plate, we can use the where used command from the Team Center ribbon within Solid Edge to quickly assess the impact of changing this part. We can see that this mounting plate is used in two different assemblies. We can quickly review previews of these assemblies, and we also see that there's a Solid Edge drawing that references this part. Let's go ahead and create a new revision. We simply select the mounting plate in the Solid Edge assembly pathfinder, and then the revise command. The revised document dialog controls this process. You can see that the revision of both the sheet metal part and the associated drawing are automatically incremented to revision E. Nice! Now we can modify the flange to solve the interference issue. Note that this component is now displayed in green in the assembly pathfinder. This tells us that the part is checked out to us to work on. The parts in orange are checked out to other members in the team. In other words, this is allowing and fully supporting a collaborative design environment. But what about the new revision of the drawing? Solid Edge notifies us that, as we have modified the plate, the drawing needs to be updated, and in doing so, the title block is updated too to revision E. Very nice. When we save the drawing, TeamCenter prompts us to upload it to the database so it's available for the manufacturing department to produce the revised part. Team Center can even automatically create a PDF at this point if we wanted. We have another modification to make. This pin needs to be extended so it can correctly locate the new plate. This time we'll use the Save As option instead of the Revise option and create a new part. 
The new document dialog is presented and we can see that both a new part and a new drawing can be created very quickly. Here we see another of the pre-configured elements of TeamCenter Rapid Start, the ability to automatically assign part numbers. In this example, we have the choice of different numbering schemes for components we manufacture ourselves or those purchased from external suppliers. Clicking on Assign All goes ahead and chooses the next available numbers in this scheme. Let's now save the assembly to the TeamCenter database. What's useful here is having the option to upload but keep checked out. This means that we can keep working on the design, say tomorrow morning, but ensure that the latest work is secure in the database and also available for others to see. Once finished, we can notify other users that this step of the ECN workflow is done. When we review the overall workflow, we can see that all of the boxes are now green. ECN complete. In summary, we've seen how TeamCenter, Rapid Start, and Solid Edge are great partners in assisting design engineers and management to perform their tasks easily and quickly, eliminating potential costly errors and speeding the completion of design changes. TeamCenter, Rapid Start, and Solid Edge, helping you design better.